Hello YouTube, just a little something different here instead of making punches and stuff. I know I get tired of it. Let me get my chair situated here. Wife got a new hair dryer, so I got this one. And this is probably over 10 years old. The newer one is the same brand. It's shorter, a lot different. Uh, it wasn't putting out enough heat. Okay, now I've cleaned this before. See the screen? I've cleaned this over the years. It's probably had this more than 10 years. Uh, well, I get it out here and I'm cleaning it all off. It laid out here in the shop and got dusty. So I'm cleaning it off. Well, I'm going to make a video, you know, clean it all off. And I noticed this. Arrow and a line. Okay, and there's a line right here. Now, I just had to this morning take a block of wood again. I took a block of wood and a hammer and got against there and hit this. Because it was just so tight. I don't dare put it back on right now. So I figured, well, I'm going to take this off, okay? So I take it off. You know, clean out some of the lint on the inside. You know, you get lint and hair and stuff. You know, so I, I, I clean, it, it's pretty good. I mean, it's been laying out in the shop. It's got dust and stuff in it now again. Well, then I got looking at it. See down in here? There's another screen. Oh. It wasn't packed full, but it had enough in there, and there's still some I can't get out. I picked at it while it's blowing, running, to try to get to blow through. But that's pretty good. But it was pretty nasty. Uh, this has little hooks on it. See that? And boy, once it's locked, it's locked. I mean, I had to really hit it. I didn't want to break it. And I just had to do it just before I did this film. There you go. Now it works good. Uh, heats up good. I even did that, the test where I block the air in the back. Don't do this at home. There's a little metal tab in here. Some electric heaters had it. It'll spark. It'll pop open. You'll lose your heat. So, then what I like about this one, see, you can cool this down before you lay it down. So, if you have it on high or medium, before you're done, pull the cool lever. It shuts the element off, so it just blows cold air. Then you can lay it down carefully, you know, lay, it's safe. It's cooled down, it's not overheated. So, I like that feature. You don't see the, I got an old hair dryer, it don't have that. It's got high meat, high and low, and it's all of it. And it's really old. Uh, I used to start the stove with it years ago, if you've seen my videos. I had air freshener can, so I had a metal spout on here. So I could shove it in the thing of the stove, barrel stove. Don't recommend doing any of that, but turbocharged. Nope, well, there you go. Don't overlook some of the obvious. And I just happen to see these little marks. So, there you go. This was a simple repair. I kept cleaning this off looking at it. You know, over the years, well, it looks okay. Amazing, huh? Thanks for watching.